Okay, this is just a short video. Wanted to talk about uh, GT 215 Fire Dancer. I saw so many videos on this from Stu and Grumpy Trev about how horrible this model was. They caught on fire, they wouldn't fly right. So I was intrigued. I bought one, changed out a few components, did a few things that I saw on, on YouTube from different uh, creators about how to fix these, how to make them work well. And it does. It worked really well. Had really good luck with it. So that inspired me to get the 220 Fire Dancer. And I wasn't so lucky with it, as you'll see from the video. This one doesn't fly nearly as well. I ended up replacing almost every component in it, and that was the end result. But it got a new life in the form of a Space One frame. Used most of the guts out of it rebuilt it, changed the camera, changed the VTX. This was an unfortunate crash, but that wasn't its fault. It's actually a much better model now, and you'll see in the video that it flies much better than it ever did in its stock configuration. Um, don't be afraid to buy the original Fire Dancer. Do not buy the GT220. Um, similar components, it doesn't fly nearly as well and with the one piece bottom frame there is no replacement part to order so you break the frame it's pretty much junk you'll find yourself rebuilding it into something else which in this case turned out pretty good in this configuration it flies much better than it ever did you know from the factory out of the box so anyway enjoy the video thank you